fans flocked to the East Hills Mall today to catch some area magicians in action. I was there early today and got to see why people say magic is fun for all ages. The mystery of magic drew many out to the East Hills Mall Saturday. Well, this is the most people I've seen out at the mall for quite some time, yeah. so yeah. this is great. It was the place to catch all kinds of magicians from across the area, performing some of their best tricks while wowing a captive audience. The next David Copperfield could be here today. Some getting the chance to participate. I got up on stage with my son here, and uh, he was very, very happy to saw me in half. Whether you're cutting people or just cutting a deck of cards, magicians say it's not an easy road to join the ranks. A lot of people ask, do you have to go to school to learn this stuff? I say, no, you have to ditch school to learn this stuff. <laughs> learn the stuff in the streets. No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> okay, all jokes aside, they say it requires lots of time and dedication. Yeah, lots of practice, a lot of sleight of hand, hours and hours. They add getting an early start helps too. Yeah, I've been doing magic ever since I was 10 years old. I got a magic set for Christmas one year, playing around with it, got hooked. Been doing it ever since. And while there were plenty of surprises for the magicians to share with the crowds, they say those crowds had a bit of a surprise for them. I even had adults sitting in on some of the magic classes. Proving you're never too old to experience the wonder of magic, even for the first time. We get to enjoy the best show because we get to watch people enjoy magic. Today's event featured balloon artists and even magic classes for people to check out. The event ran from 11 to about 4 o'clock this afternoon. National day inside the East Hill Shopping Mall as the International Brotherhood of Magicians hosted its annual Magic, Magicians, and Mayhem event. For the third time, about a dozen magicians appeared at the mall to perform shows and free magic classes and uh, give free mag magic classes for kids. Patrons were also treated to balloon artists and other entertainment Magician Dave Sandy says he's been doing magic for 50 years and enjoys giving back to today's youth. I teach to the kids some things that I remember learning when I was a kid that inspired me to become a magician. And since I've been a magician, magic started out as a hobby, is literally taking me all over the world and it's become a career for me. So, If you missed this year's event, make sure to head over to our website, newspressnow.com, for more information about next year's event.